we're, we're very, very fortunate. You know, Mictors is a little team, but I think we just have such incredible people here. Um, you know, Willie Pratt, you know, who started in the industry at, uh, at age 18, um, and I actually, you know, met him um, through, you know, one of the most wonderful men I've ever met in my lifetime, uh, the late Owsley Brown, uh, who ran Brown for him, and who's just such an incredible man, such an incredible gentleman, such an incredible executive at just such a fantastic company. Um, and it was actually uh, through Owsley that I wound up meeting Willie, who eventually became my master distiller. Um, you know, but somebody like him just had so much experience and uh, it's just, it's just the really great people. You know, Pamela Heilman, uh, you know, with her experience, you know, it, it, for years uh, running the Booker No Distillery. Um, uh, you know, the people that you work with are just really, really, really critical. And, you know, there's so much knowledge. Um, you know, one of the things that, and I'm, and I'm sure that there, are, there must be, you know, good schools and, you know, obviously a lot of the great people have chemical backgrounds, chemistry backgrounds. But, um, you know, it's not like you can just sort of like, you know, call up a headhunter in this industry and say, hey, you know, find me a great distiller. Um, you know, it, it, it really is a craft. Um, and these people really are craftsmen and these people really have had apprenticeships for incredible mentors. You know, Pam worked for Jerry Dalton, you know, at Jim Beam, um, you know, another, you know, giant in the industry. And, um, you know, there, there's, um, the, the people are just so important, so, so important. You know, when you have some of these, you know, great whiskey legends, uh, like Jimmy Russell, you know, from Wild Turkey, you know, who, who's one of the nicest men I've ever met in my life. Uh, when you have people like him, you know, traveling around the world, doing a great job, and, you know, people like Chris Morris, you know, from Brown Foreman, traveling around the world, you know, doing great presentations, doing great work. Um, I, I think it doesn't just help their own uh, brands. I think that it sort of spearheads things for the whole industry and really, you know, increases, um, you know, the, it just increases the visibility for bourbon around the world and shows people that, you know, hey, American bourbon is fantastic. I mean, it, it, it's, it's up there with the great whiskeys and the great spirits of, of the world made anywhere.